Welcome ICBM fans, my name is Dark Guardsman. I am one of the uh, co-devs for the ICBM Sentry Project. Today I will be showing you the AA Sentry Gun, which is over here in its uh, textureless form. Yeah, still need to get a texture for it. Still got a lot of work to work on it, but uh, for the moment it's uh, enough just to show you the fact that it actually does work. We'll actually shoot things like zombies. So you got a zombie here, it'll shoot at, well, Hard to tell from the well, it's tangent the night, so you guys can tell. Oh, well, you can tell that way. It just it's got a knockback effect that with how the AA gun is designed will accidentally shoot it upward when it really should only be able to shoot it back. It's something I gotta work out later, but uh let's let's show you that it can actually shoot down uh things like gas. Since uh some of you might actually be using it for uh single player mode where you don't have to worry about people shooting you with uh, missiles. And yeah, it'll hit the gas, it'll kill it pretty fast. I mean, it does a decent amount of damage. As after all, it is designed to kill things that don't have normal HP. But let's show you the primary purpose over here, which happens to be a missile. I've got this missile pointed at that target in the back. Pull this lever, it'll fire. And if we're lucky, they go and shoot it down. Which, because of how the AA gun is designed, it has a low hit to kill ratio. It is not going to kill the missile every time because after all you are shooting something that's about the, a little bit smaller than a 50 caliber round at a missile which even if it hits it's not going to do a major amount of damage and the missile will be able to still get to its target. However on the chance it does, which to increase this chance I recommend getting a lot of sentries, though I'm probably going to increase the chance to kill because even I don't like to get my base hit by missiles when I invest in a lot of sentry guns. But uh, we'll load this a couple more times and see if we can get it to go off. And it's a dud. Which mo missile monitors actually end up dudding, by the way, if you didn't know that. They'll, they'll hit the target and they'll just drop. Other missiles, you're going to get some actual damage. So I'm starting to get curious whether or not this sentry gun is more worried about shoot. Up oh, there we go. It shot it down a little bit close to the target, which uh, the way it's designed is it'll prematurely detonate the missile when it kills it. So you'll get basically the equivalent to a single TNT detonation, which is pretty good. I mean, it, if you're unlucky and that missile just happened to be close to something, you might lose some glass, but nothing major. It's better than a nuclear missile going off. But yeah, I do need to increase the uh, kill ratio now that I'm realizing it. It's currently at like 60% miss chance. Which is, um, realistic AA guns, they focused more on let's spit a whole bunch of bullets in the air rather than let's actually hit the target. Though, more recently we use actual missiles to do it, which is this is actually designed off of a uh, mix between a German AA gun from World War II and a Russian... AA gun from the Cold War. That's where the radar dish comes from on the top. It's I actually put some effort into this. Try to get good, but uh, yeah, I got some more work to do on the animations to make it uh, animate well. The cannons have got to knock back. Same for the the other sentry gun. I haven't got around to it. The events don't really trigger client side, so it's kind of hard to get graphics to trigger when it doesn't even know it's shooting. But uh, yeah, and, well, we got this over here. One warning though is if you're uh, using an AA gun to guard your uh, missile launchers, be warned, when you actually launch the missile, one second after it launches, the AA gun will start to shoot it. So it's best not to have AA guns near your missile silos, or you will lose missiles. I might figure out a way to change this later with uh, Cal Calavia's permission to add something to the, these uh, launchers that the sentry guns can identify the missiles that are yours. Maybe go for targeting range, but uh, due to that fact that antimatter missiles have a huge radius, it's hard to determine if a missile is going to hit in your biocentric gun or not. But yeah, that's, that's about it. And we put a couple more gas down here to show you that it just loves to kill things. It's pretty good. Uh, it, it's Though it does spit through ammo really, really fast, it fires a, a round a second. It'll actually spit out six times more shells than a sentry gun. 
and we'll target everything the same as Cinch Gun, because you notice this is, this is trying to shoot the gas, but this has no ammo, so it can't do crap. But yeah, we're pretty good. Put a good texture on this, uh, I gotta get to my artist to make it look good like this. My equivalent of textures are horrible, they look worse than Minecraft. But uh, that, that's all, and uh, hopefully I'll have this done sometime by uh, May the 5th.